Hi everyone, I've been uh, playing at a new site today. A few of you have recommended that I have a crack at Party Casino. Um, and I'm afraid the, uh, the party has sort of turned a bit sour during play here. It cost £1,000 here to get 10 bonuses, uh, mainly on 60p, 70p and 75p sort of stakes here. I just, I mean, if you look at the list there, what a shocking start. 196 for five lions and then 192 without a bonus on Beetlejuice. So the best part of 400 spent and only one bonus in the bank. Um, absolutely rubbish. And bear in mind, Beetlejuice is, uh, is a 50p uh, minimum stake uh, there, or 50p I choose to play on rather than uh, pound is the next jump up. So that was awful. It did improve slightly after that. And then Hippo Pop down the bottom, 189 without a bonus. But anyway, I carried on for a bit and uh, had a reasonable conclusion there with uh, three bonuses landing out of the bottom four attempts there. So we've got a massive uphill struggle today. I'm going to play one that I haven't played for ages, actually, mainly because it doesn't have the uh, autoplay on the site I regularly visit, which is Wheel of Fortune Megaways. Right, here we go. Wheel of Fortune Megaways. Just going to lower that slightly because the, uh, Give that the parameters seem to be slightly off there. So that should get everything into the screen. Hopefully you can all see that okay. 12 free spins, obviously need high megaways, ideally. Oh, 100,000, that would do. Lovely jubbly. Well, that's a crappy start. Can we make the most of it? I think that's the second best one on here. Well, this one wheel of fortune, there, yeah, probably on the, on the one that had the lowest, uh, lowest megaways, huh? Anyway, a couple more there, putting us up to, to, to uh, eight. There's ten to qualify. And two lots of nine now. Well, this, all of a sudden, this is, uh, this is interesting. Decent amount of kings there as well. Well, wilds there, but still no re-trigger on those nines. Come on, we want to get this re-trigger, give ourselves a chance. Well, slow spins, and it looks like the red uh, planes most of the way there. So, what's that given? Well, not bad, 11 and a 9 there, so £20 worth there. Yeah, very good. Yes, re-triggered. Happy days. Splendid stuff. Right. I think you just spin the wheel again. Yeah, you want to avoid the uh, threes here. So, yeah, five and above would be chuffed with. Seven, seven. Go on, get up, get up. Oh, five it is. Still got that chance of the fourth reel re-triggering as well here. Well, I've got a, uh, another wild there. Uh, not another wild, another scatter. Huge potential here if we can just get one more re-trigger. No, again, not re-triggered. Not a bad round, that one, but uh, no re-trigger. Oh, wow. That's got to be worth a few pennies. Crikey, how much is that in wins? I mean, we've got the purple uh, symbol there, which is the top one any case. And an absolute belter of a round. I 
Yeah, bring it on. Keep coming. I've just got a thousand pounds to make back here. I need good bonuses. Right, if we can re-trigger it. Oh, one last chance on the full thrill. It's not done it. What a shame. But anyway, that's a cracking start to the uh, bonus hunt. They're absolutely delighted with that. 127.83. Uh, really, really good. Wow, you won the big one! Yeah, okay. Well, let's uh, one, two, seven. It's a good start. Press for luck. Oh, uh, tease. Oh. oh, let's give it one more. Maybe it's in the mood. Oh, what a shame. That had been marvellous if that had dropped in. Anyway, let's move on. Next one is a relatively new game, Invaders Megaways. It's a bit slow to play, but it did churn quite well. It's, uh, I suppose it's slightly similar mechanics uh, to Beetlejuice, same uh, same company, I believe, that uh, that makes it. So they uh, they like to keep you in for the long haul. Oh, long haul all the way into space. Right, here we go. Quick recap. Had chances to land the extra scatter here, which would have been fun. But it uh, wasn't to be. Seven free spins. Well, it's wild there, but uh, not much use, really. Can ill afford dud spins. We had a good start on the uh, on the other one. Uh, two stacks. Oh, it has connected in fairness. But one pound ninety two doesn't really do it. Got another wild there. Ah, no more cows, sadly. And another dud spin. How many have we got left now? Two. And we're on £3.81. Good grief. Any chance of a win? Yeah, we've got one there. Plenty of wilds there. £30. Good lord. Well, I'll take your word for it. Well, a splendid last round there, in fairness. That uh, rescued a bonus from utter oblivion there. It was garbage before that. So, anyway, £34.89 off this uh, Slow Invaders game. Right, now what's happening? Do we win anything extra? No, that's it. Right, let's move on. Uh, every press will be uh, about 20 minutes of my life. Uh, and yours. <laughs> Let's move on. Right, Christmas Carol Megaways. Now, I'm going to go down the middle here, 10 by 5. Oh, it doesn't show you the mystery. I forgot about that. It's a shame. It does on the uh, clone of this, the uh, Great Rhino. Oh, uh, snippets there. Uh, a couple of outshots. No. Well, I got the maid there. Need the uh, ace or king, I suppose. Ah, oh, missed out again. Huh. Well, plenty of maids. How much is that worth? Thirty-three pounds. Marvelous. Excellent. That was a cracking round. That one. Much more like it. Thirty-three pounds, sir. Eh? Excellent. Got a wild and it connects to tens. Ah, oh, the outshots are blocked there. Come on, let's have one more good one. 
Oh, there was some made again, but didn't connect. Oh, how's this time though? In fine style. Thirty-six pounds there. Brilliant stuff. Yeah, super win. They're an excellent way to finish. Goodness me, if that had connected to the uh, the fifth reel, we could be uh, talking hundreds rather than uh, rather than sort of uh, low low sort of uh, well, not a hundred quite, was it? Oh, I don't know. What? <laughs> Anyway, it's 86.40. Let's uh, cut it short. Uh, right, press for luck. Well, a couple of out shots. Let's have one more. Well, good start to this bonus hunt, I must say. Right, next one is Wubba Lubba Dub Dub. I'm going to collect probably me seeks if it lands that high. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, I said I would, so better stick with my word. Last time I had Anatomy Wild, it wasn't much cop actually, so it gave about twenty-five or thirty pounds, which was quite disappointing. This can go big. Um, it's a while since I've seen a decent array of me seeks, but who knows? Maybe they've tightened this game up a bit. Oh, that's a dreadful start. It really is. I wish I gambled already. Well, cheers for turning up. Much obliged. Pins to go and seven places still to fill here. No, I needed a big round there and got absolutely nothing off it. So, well, that's much better. That's more like it. A decent base win, in fairness, as well. So, all of a sudden, we've got a bit of uh, potential here. There's Mr. Me Seeks. Look at him. Well, another one's there in the bottom row, so that should be times two on the multiplier there. So, if you can a good symbol on the uh, bottom when the uh, fun last spin comes round. And we've got another one there in the middle, which is uh, middle left, which is good. So, from a dreadful start, if you can land a good symbol or two on the first reel, we've got a chance here. Yeah? Well, it's a picture symbol, so I can't grumble with that. Right, how much is that going to be? The coins are, uh, are there, so anything over £30 would be happy enough with that. Yeah, slightly under what I expected. 23 34 But... Uh, in actual fact, with the, uh, the the base win that we got during play there, it's £36.78 bonus, which is more than I got on the uh, uh, the feature above this last time I uh, I took it. So, can't, can't really grumble with that. A groovy win, if not uh, a sort of moderate, uh, moderate to reasonable one. Right, let's have this lucky press in. Massively overdue on my lucky presses. I must uh, must make a tally chart of how uh, how many I've gone uh, without hitting one. Now must be in several hundreds now. Five lions megaways now. I do like the ten spins on this game with the chance of getting a times thirty. So I prefer this end of the board really. Twenty five was marginally better than the base win was showing but it was only a three five or eight win multiplier on the mystery that was well i've landed the symbol there it does tend to uh, just default to 10x most of the time it's more about the uh, wins you get alongside it really ah mr re-trigger and no spins and another dud round there, typical. 
Right, that's better though, but 10x again. Anyway, decent win. King on the first, keep it going. Well, that was a good round, that one, I must say. Four spins to go. Yeah, what did that give? 23. Oh, I didn't connect. Shame. And yeah, asking a lot now. No, not to be. Disappointing one, that. 26.40. It can can go really big this game. Maybe I should have taken mystery. 25 spins would have been uh, a lot better there. But uh, there we go. Madam Destiny Megaways now. Still to hit the elusive 25 spins or 25x with any any decent amount of spins on this game, really. 5x, yeah, 10 will do. Uh, no, put the brakes on. Right, what's this rubbish that keeps appearing in the corner? Get out of it. Eight free spins. Well, hearts o'clock. Uh, that's decent. Twenty-four pounds. Need that cat. Oh, where was the lucky cat? Ah, oh, sorry about this. That keeps cropping up in the left corner. Don't know how I can get rid of it. Oh, that's made it worse. Right. I'll try and figure out a way to get rid of that. It's really irritating. I didn't even enter a competition. It must have entered me by default. Right, anyway, that's another good win there. Ten pounds. God, it's really distracting me. Um, right, nothing happening there. Aces, that's decent. Need a king on the second. And landed it, good out. Right, how about that lucky black cat? Just a nice there, anyway. That was another good round and an enjoyable bonus, this one. Oh, I can't keep doing it, putting it low. Um, right. Tens there. I need a candle on the second. That would have been a decent win if we'd got that. Anyway, £56, 55 pence. I'm ranked 2,041 from whatever blooming competition that uh, I've inadvertently entered on this site i won't be winning a single crumb off that yet it keeps uh, interfering with the uh, bonuses i'll try and switch that off uh, uh, if it keeps uh, keeps reappearing or do something to reset it anyway apologies for that let's have a press for luck great rhino megaways now as I did quite well on the Christmas carols going down the middle, I'm going to go with 10 by 5 here. Ah, oh, it was 15 by 10 on the mystery. I so nearly took that as well. Ah, oh, frustrating. Blast, right. And two duds just to uh, rub salt in the wounds there. All right, okay, I didn't take the mystery, goodness me. It's uh, really paying the price now. That could be reasonable if it connects. No, uh, only £4. Oh, I could have landed a queen, couldn't it? Well, oh, snippets out. Any chance of a crock? Or the... No, no chance. Really annoyed I didn't take mystery there. Really annoyed. I was so close to doing so. And had, this, had all these bonuses not cost quite so much to obtain, maybe I would have done. Uh, frustrated at myself there. And three scatters there. Eh? 
Right, let's move on. Oh, hold on, there's a small win there. Buffalo King Mega Ways. Now, at least I don't get a choice on this. All right, miles down on these bonuses at the moment. Really need one to go off the scale. We get a winning press on the first go on a bonus. Is it not possible to do that? Right, a few bits there. Need a stag on the first. Yeah, I've got one in fairness. All the way over. Wow, okay, now we're talking. So, times six on that, £92.16. Yeah, I've got moan enough, uh, eventually it'll give a win. So, goodness me, I'm still, still kicking myself over that last game. But anyway, that, uh, that now at least uh, relinquishes some of the, uh, the pain I'm feeling there. £92, brilliant. And I've got the wolf chap there. Uh, £1.32. Well, quite a few tens there, but no multi-pass at all. Oh, re-trigger, please. No, very rare on this game, but it would have been fun at least. Got a multiplier lurking there. Uh, not much though, didn't pick up much in the base wins. So, itching our way to £100. And that should ensure we uh, just about make it there. Times three, another multiplier maybe? Come on, let's put another multiplier in. Yes, brilliant. Times three. Any wins there? No. But anyway, great round that one. £46.98. I think I deserve a pat on the back for cheering that, uh, that one in. £49. Or £46. £146 in the bank now. Well, a couple of duds to end, but it doesn't really matter so much on this game because it's not a progressive multiplier on the game and I'm actually chuffed of 146 22 off that so I'm gradually e eking my way back to the uh, starting balance in all honesty I would have been delighted to have just got over 500 with the uh, selection so I've already done that with, uh, with some games to go Wildflower now I don't hold out a huge amount of hope for this it's just a normal bonus so I'm going to go for the one on the left. At least I don't, there isn't the skull on this uh, that you can hit anymore. Uh, when I get a spare moment one rainy day, I'm going to count up how many skulls I actually get, have had on Danger High Voltage in comparison to, um, to other symbols. It's probably about 40%, I reckon. Anyway, let's commentate on the present. So that's uh, one queen landed there while I was waffling on. And we've got another one there. Well, a couple more queens there. If we can get one on the um, second reel there, all of a sudden we, uh, we'll pick up a few pennies. So that's £18 for the, uh, well, it looks like a blue hand or footprint or whatever it is. Um, there, so not, not bad there. And four spins still to go. So really neat one on that second reel. Oh, instead of which we get a complete dead spin. Well, tens go all the way over there. But yeah, we're really missing out for not having that second reel. Are they taking the queens off the game while I wasn't watching? I mean... <laughs> well, ace is there, but I've got to admit, with four spins left there, I really thought it um, could be on for a decent bonus here, or maybe a re-trigger. But uh, there we go, £37 and 32 Pence. It really put the brakes on a bit uh, on that one. Uh, one more press. Well, I'm hoping this is a case of saving the best till last. 
I've got an astonishing six wild symbols here. So, goodness knows what the spin potential is here. We have seen marvellous stuff. I've actually got a half decent base win to collect still as well. So, all is not lost. Anyway, there's the standard four symbols. There's the fifth. Bear with me. There we go. Six scatters. Right. Pick a safe. Can we unlock some corkers? What does it go up to? Up to 30. Good grief. 27. Bring it on. What a shot. Top choosing, GG. 27. Brilliant stuff. Right, fighting chance here. Oh, the slow up. I thought we'd have got the bars there. Oh, please don't dead spin your way through it. Anyway, the seven's there. That's good. Five pounds ten. Need some connectors early doors and we could have some good fun with this. them there. Mystery symbols at some point would be nice. Get good connector there though. Need that queen on the second. Well, up to times four now with 19 to go. Well, possible re-trigger opportunity here. And another chance at the re-trigger. Go on, I dare you. Oh, shame. Anyway, this is good for getting the multiplier going. Yeah, great round, that one. Ah, oh, three dead spins in a row. Make it four. Come on, game. Right, diamonds, jacks, what have we got there? £5.76. Got the tens, need that diamond, or a king on the second would be alright, actually. Times ten multiplier anyway now. £2.40 there. And got the jacks. Really need to see a good round of mysteries here. Well, 15.84, that's better. And a 9 on the first would be good. Oh, I can't believe that's missed. Anyway, not a bad round. Mysteries, and we've got the diamonds there. How much are they worth? Eighty-three pounds worth. Marvelous. Seven on the second would, would go down well. No, not to be. But what a cracking round that was. That's more like it. I was rather fearing this bonus was just going to tail off into uh, into oblivion. It's not every day you get twenty-seven spins on it. Six to go. Oh yes, re-trigger a clock. Bring it on. Right, do I get another 27 for that? Just five. Anyway, we're in there with nines. A uh, couple of outshots on the first. No, that wasn't, uh, that wasn't it. Well, we just hit one good round of mysteries here really blow the doors off. Well, a decent collection of aces, £11 there. 
Yeah, good to get the queens. So another good round that one, it's all adding up. Just need one belter of a round here. It's the last five spins. Oh yes, mysteries, come on. Ah, oh, blimmin' nines. Ugh, how lousy. Queen's probably the only out shot there. Yeah, I didn't land. Blimmin' nines, I don't believe it. Oh wow, that's more like it though, loads of mysteries. King, so 30 pounds there. And it looks like that's the lot. So, anyway, an absolutely splendid bonus to uh, wrap up proceedings there. I'm still well down on the um, on the cost of this bonus hunt, but it's an actual actually it's an awful lot better than uh, than it was looking uh, when I started here. So 191.28, absolutely chuffed a bit. But with the base win, in fact, it's even more than that. Sorry about that. A few hiccups in the. Uh, back of the throat there 194.82 so let's let it add this up and then um, then we'll see where we are uh, in terms of the closing balance here well it looks like that's 700 and, well after my press for luck it's 751 there so a bit of an expensive outing really all in all to this casino first time I've attempted it and well I've had a 250 loss but really I've got to be chuffed with that 10 bonuses and in fairness a lot of them paid well today so it did actually make a very entertaining bonus hunt I was actually quite uh, quite excited uh, playing this last game here with 27 spins there so I'm thinking uh, maybe I'll pick up a bag of sand on that uh, that bonus alone but it wasn't to be it was a uh, probably a bit far-fetched so in the end settling for 200 off that um well work to do i'll have another crack at this site probably at some point in the uh, in the near future it does offer an alternative to my regular sites and i must say one thing there is a good selection of games here and the return to percentages do seem to be set to a fair level i think i just had some very rotten luck today on uh well, what was it, that uh, uh, that pop game that I played, Hippo Pop, and also the um, Beetlejuice. Um, so, yeah, if it wasn't for those two, take those two out of the equation, I'd have actually been in profit on the, uh, on the site. So there we go. It uh, really shows the uh, ups and downs of uh, this sort of gambling lark. And, uh, yeah, as I say to all of you, you know, it's... Uh, you know, make sure if you are having a punt, just uh, only uh, gamble what you can uh, afford. And uh, if it stops becoming fun, uh, you know, I'd advise to uh, to stop and uh, have a little uh, little break from it because it can get frustrating uh, at times. You know, I'm lucky in that uh, what I play with here, I can afford uh, to lose. So uh, hence why I stay at realistic stakes, 60p, and I'll probably have the odd venture at. Uh, one pound from time to time but i'm certainly not going any uh, bigger than that regular followers of the site would have seen my uh, 2000 subscriber special where um, i played at two pound a stake and it was absolutely horrifying so uh, don't ever want to go down uh, that route again so anyway hope you enjoyed that video uh, real action-packed one and uh, yeah probably an important sort of uh, message maybe comes across during that video as well Anyway, all the best. Bye for now.